Well, I, I think it's just the beginning for us just starting to introduce uh, some of the philosophies um, in, in the ways in which we want them to play. So it's been very individualized based uh, in, in that aspect with repetition day in and day out. The key is going to be following through within our regular trainings uh, as we come out of this camp to, to be able to instill. But yeah, we, ha we have seen as the week has gone on a little bit more of the instruction uh, starting to become uh, more part of their game. Now, when you first talked about this camp, you were talking about uh, learning to play the national way. Mm -hmm. um, have you defined that, that, that way and, and how have the youngsters uh, embraced that? Um, well, I, today, this week has been more about the individual player. Um, what are some of the things we want them to do? Pass and move, um, to keep the ball running, uh, play when they don't have the ball. Uh, just the, the, the little cue points uh, from those aspects to try to get them. The next camp would really focus on building the team units. How does the defensive unit play? How do we play in a flat back four? Uh, how do we play with the holding the defensive midfielder and attacking midfielders play in the attacking third? So at that point, we'll be able to put a little bit more of the team structure. Um, so it is, is a journey that we're embarking on. We're here at the beginning of the year. Uh, starting and we're hoping that by the time we get through to the end of the year two things will happen. Uh, the style of play will be a little bit more evident within our players uh, and our team play and we will also have produced uh, the curriculum document which will outline our model of play and our model of training. Uh, so that's something that's ongoing that the coaches are, are having input that we will meet to develop over the course of this year. Um, one of the biggest things is obviously with them being full-time and the academy staff not being full-time, they're able to be here throughout the day, whereas academy coaches are kind of in and out according to, to their work schedule. Um, but definitely they're working with the players and then they're able to highlight those players that they think are, are maybe our elite level players. And we have the opportunity to, to offer some incentives with programming for them looking into the future. Go.